mic and we're finished with the uh week one of the ultimate seasons man winning this julius edelman pack and we did it using our drag scheme as you can see man just drag tavon out we cleared out everybody on that side right so we drag tavon out and all we got nothing but green in front of him man and we don't get it we get an at the one we get stuffed at the one right so we try to run it they wasn't having any of it they blew us up right i'm thinking like yo man what's gonna happen then we try to do another run by denard not so good then finally since they used their timeouts they couldn't ice us and then we just go in ahead man kick the field goal and get the w you know what i'm saying really good thing man um going ahead to get this item man i mean these listen man these solos have been so tough toward the end i think the hardest one is actually um i think the cardinals i think that's the cardinals where you're down by eight and it's not even that much time left so you have to score and then go into overtime with him, dude. It's just really, really hard. As we get this uh, Julius Thomas item, man. 81 overall, man. Really nice card, man. Really nice card. And he has a uh, different Kim. He has ultimate offense Kim, which is going to give him one speed, one plus in speed, which is nice. Okay, so ultimate offense Kim gives you one plus speed, one plus acceleration, and one plus stiff arm. That's really nice, man. Now, how many things does it take to enact? Oh my god, you need four people to enact this Kim? Wow, that's kind of crazy. Well, I guess it's you play more solos. I guess that will, you know, you'll be able to unlock these Kims, but uh yeah, man, Skies looks looks pretty nice. I mean, looking at his stats, man, 84 speed is really nice. 84 catching, 82 catching traffic. Um 86 spec catch, 70 run block. Really really nice, man. Oh, almost about to quick sell him, dude. Let's compare him. We already have a Julius Thomas, a 79 overall. And he's pretty, I mean, you know, just a couple of ratings ab above this one. But um, what I like is the 84 speed. You know what I'm saying? I'm definitely loving that 84 speed and uh, the updated catching, especially with catching traffic and run block. You know, just a few slight upgrades, a few slight upgrades, but we will take it. Uh, these 16 games, they were kind of easy, but the last few were just really, really crazy, man. Just really hectic, dude. Let's see. Let's go ahead and... Whoa. Uh, we'll do that later. But, yeah, let me show you the solos. Let me show you the solos. That's really, really tough. Can you stop doing that, please? Thank you. Uh, not this one. This one, the Cardinals, dude. That one is going to be tough when you're down eight and only 50 seconds remaining. And it's just really, really tough because you have to go for two. You have to go for two. And Tyron Matthew and Pat P will guard those edges, dude. And just really, really stressful. But we finally got through it, dude. Um, I just used my scheme, my drag route, my slant scheme. And it, it basically worked for me, dog. It's going to eat your contracts up, though. Let's go ahead and purchase some contracts so these guys can stop bugging us. It's crazy that we always have to purchase contracts, bruh. Oh, already. And we haven't done any of the milestones for today. And what's today? The rushing milestone. So I guess the milestone players are available too. But I also got the day on Buchanan, man. So let's go ahead and check out day on. And uh, check out our newest acquisitions right so let's go to newest really quickly I don't want to take up too much of you guys time man um Deion Buchanan man really nice card dude really nice card okay we already have a day on and uh I wonder if we can run two day ons or that's not the thing this year if, if you can't do it let's try it we're gonna try but like I say, both of these guys are pretty, pretty good. I mean, both cards are super solid, bro. Like, it's just a point. I think these cards are just a point above what their regular cards are. But then they have the uh, the chemistry scheme. So, I mean, that's that's a thing. You know what I'm saying? Um, let's see here. What chemistry would actually be better 
thinking about it. Okay, this one gives you one plus tackle, one plus impact, what? one plus jumping, and one plus man coverage. This one gives you one plus speed. Okay, instantly better. More speed, more ex acceleration. Okay, that's definitely better. All right, definitely. And it only takes four to enact that cam. So, really, really nice, man. Um, let's see, man. Oh, oh, oh. I wanted to show you guys something. A quick little peek. I'm trying to do this budget thing, man. And I'm thinking about doing budget users as well. This guy here is pretty nice, man. Uh, he doesn't go for that much either. Zavar Gooden. Dude, check out the stats. Now, this is for user cards, all right? This is not for somebody, you know, you can just leave by himself. I mean, you can leave him by himself, but look at his stats, man. He has 86 speed, right? 6'1". He doesn't, he doesn't have the greatest block shed, but he has good zone coverage and 85 hit power, all right? Really, really nice card, man. I don't know, comparing him to... Some of the better cards, he kind of have, you know, stays, uh, well, he can't beat them, but he definitely stays up there. You know, it's not like a big drop off. You know what I'm saying? Only like in play rec and things like that. But other than that, this card is nice, but this is a good user card. This is what I would call a really good user card, dude. And it's all about the speed. Speed kills him, Matt. We all know this, but this is a really good user card. And I think I got this guy for like 600 coins. He's not going for that much. Well, now he is. Okay. Uh, well, I did get him for 600 coins. Now he's up there. But he is pretty good, man. I, you know, people don't... It don't take long for people to find out good cards, man. It don't take long. You know what I'm saying? But um, definitely, definitely, man, worth doing. Uh, got two milestone players. I don't need both of those guys. I'm probably going to sell one. Um, oh, and this is another guy for your my drag scheme I wanted to show you guys because I didn't get a chance to show you guys before. This guy, Hakeem Grant, 92 speed, right? 79 catching. Not that good, but on drags, you only need him to catch in about a, a you know, three or four yard radius. And then he's going to turn up field and then turn up. You know what I'm saying? So, Hakeem Grant and Tyreek Hill, man, definitely two guys I would suggest as sleepers. You know what I'm saying? Now, don't bomb it out to these guys. It's not going they're not gonna catch it. But a five yard catch, a five yard slant, of uh, uh, you know, a four yard drag, they're definitely catching, and they'll turn up the field and get the rest. You know what I mean? And that's what I use them for. But um, yeah, man, that's it for this one. Um, what else do we have? What else? What else? What else? I think that's it, man. We got both of these guys to the squad. Let's go ahead and add them to this to this slot. I don't know where we're gonna put Julius Thomas though. I, I guess, you know what? I might go ahead. Well, no, I can't do that. I might uh, go ahead and put him under Jordan Cameron. That's what I'm going to do. Or maybe we just give him a try. To, you know what? We'll start him. Let's see. What, I mean, you know, we've had Gronk in there for the longest. Let's go ahead and give somebody else a chance for a while. See what he does. Oh, you already have one. Okay, so they're stopping the dupes, huh? They're stopping the duplicates, bro. Okay. So where's the Julius Thomas hiding at? Oh, is he here? Oh, okay. So we'll just do Julius Thomas there. And then we'll go ahead and make him the starter. How about that? So we can't run two Dayons. Oh, man. Okay. So we can't run two Dayons. It's okay. It's okay. That just means I will be able to sell this other Dayon and get my coins. That's pretty nice. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. All right. And so we just need some move for more people to add to those Kims. But yeah, man, that's it for this one. Uh, did you guys do these solos yet? They are tough. But I will see you guys on the next one, man. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this, right? And uh, definitely follow me on social media if you guys want to. That's just Mike77 on Twitter and Instagram, bro. And also, um, you can sub to my other channel, Social Media One TV. It's a lot of good, like, hip-hop news and stuff like that. So that's it for this one, man. We got these two guys. They are home, all right? They on is home, bro. User God is home. But that's it for this one, man. I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out.
Peace.